What do you think of Lieutenant King? Oh, Lieutenant King, the the guy who thinks he was in Vietnam. He he wasn't in Vietnam. No, he was never in Vietnam. He thinks he's fighting communists. I'm pretty sure he actually just hates minorities. That's why he dresses up like that and yells racial slurs at all the Asian neighbors. Oh, f they're coming in from the left. This is the end, beautiful friend. This is the end, my only. So I'm hanging out here and I'm hiding out here in this here hotel in Hanoi. It's the only place I know that they're friendly to Americans. My name's Lieutenant King and I hunt commies. Yeah, one time he shot my cat with a real gun. Yeah, I don't know how he got the permit either, but I don't even know how I survived. He got, he got shot in the head. I took it to the vet immediately, and somehow they got to live again. So that I, he has like a little device in his brain now that helps him breathe. Yeah, science, right? One time, me and my boys, we were a... Uh... Yeah, man. Bring back my memories. We were, uh, we were stationed. Uh, out north somewhere, and oh, there was this little boy, this little this little Vietnamese boy. He came running. He was holding something in his hand. We were all, oh, fuck. he's got a bomb for sure. So I took, oh, fuck. oh well, I took this here rifle. I mean, it had bullets in it at the time. I shot him straight in the face. <laughs> shot him right in the face. Our times, man. Well, that's what war does to you. You didn't flush. Yeah, I gotta keep myself military strong. You never know when them Chinese can attack. They can bust through that door any minute and I have to be... Um, Lieutenant King, there's, there's not a door. There's always a door. There's always a Chinese b trying to open it. Yeah, the other day, he threw a firebomb at my car, and he said it was a Kong tank. How does this guy get away with this? He's been doing this for five years, and every time he does something like this, which, let me remind you, is very frequent, I call the cops. They never do anything about it. How does he keep getting away with this? What? What did the cops say? They just say, they think he's like a daring or something. I don't know what about bombing my car is a daring. You know, being out here all day, thinking about how much I've seen, really does do a lot to a man. Like, we were, Me and my squadron, we were, we were, uh, we were stationed somewhere, and uh, this, this old lady, this little old lady, she comes, she goes, she asked me if I wanted paper or plastic, and uh, well, I thought at the time, I thought she was saying, you know, some Chinese or Vietnamese about how America sucks. So I slit her throat. Been out here such a long time. Been uh, out for five years. That means I haven't seen my wife in five years. You know? My little daughter Eileen, she, she must be 37 now. When I left, she was only 15. Five years is a long time. I miss my wife's little I miss her. I'll take me back. I remember we go, ah, at least every day.
Uh, Lieutenant King? <sighs> Lieutenant King? You know what? What you want, boy? We have an interview. About what? About you f***ing your wife, sir. Shit. I don't have a wife. 